Hi, so I'm going to show you how to add a row here so we can get your supporters all in the row looking nice. Um, so what your page looks like now is down here. Um, they're just in a row. And we're going to take this one section here and we're going to make it four columns. I think that'll look nice. Um, with these logos. So let's come up here. And so in the future, you'll just have to add another row. Um, so here we go. So take the green arrow. These are your, you can see how the, the box around <clears throat> turns green. Add a new row here. And then this is where you select how many um, columns you want in the row. So we'll probably go with four here. And then we're going to insert, what are we going to add in here? Um, we're going to throw an image and select the image you want. Here's the children's meeting house. And I uh, should probably put uh, an alt text tag in here. And I like to copy it to the title. And then just double check the size um, is full size and then click upload. And so that looks nicely there. And then if you wanted this to link to their website, um, all you do is come in here, click the link, and then add in the URL here. Um, I'm not sure what their website is. Um, or even if you want to do that. But So that's the option here to, to do that. Um, and then when you're done, and this looks good, you can just click the uh, save changes. So let's come in here. We're going to add another image over here. We'll add the next one in. I'll just fill this in for you. Um, let's see. Harbor City. Oops, I want to find by. And then um, once I get it, I'm actually just going to add a bunch. I'll just add a few and I'll add the, the tags later. Because um, I'm going to show you what we're going to do. You can move them around so it looks nice. Um, ah, here we go. I'm in school. And then, so <clears throat> when this is done, you can clone a row, or sorry, duplicate it, clone it, same thing. Um, and that just makes a copy of that. So you can come in here, open up the settings, and then just add a new image. We'll do Charlestown Nursery School. Click the arrow to save it. Campus. Save that. Um, I think this is another one. And then this will be. So I don't know if there's an, a particular order you want to do these in. Um, there we go. We'll close out of that. But you can um, say all the, the square ones you can put in the same row together. So you can just drag and, and save here. Um, and then just drag and save this down to the other row right here. Um, and otherwise, you can do something like this, make it a little bit smaller. Um, and we're just going to, I'm going to save this and uh, delete out this row. Just make sure I think I got everybody in there. Yeah. All right. And I'm just going to trash this. So you've got your text here, your intro. Here's your donate button. Um, I don't know who you want to bump up there. Child's on nursery. Um, and that is how you um, add the rows. And then, yeah, so then when you're done, you just click save. Um, then 
I find the easiest way to do it is just duplicate this row uh, when you're in the, vi the visual builder and then you can just click this gear and then switch it out. Um, and uh, that's that. So let's save it and close out and take a look and see how this looks. There you go. And there's your bottom. So looks good. Um, and that way that you can you, you can adjust the size. You can even add, I think, I think up to eight eight in one row. Um, make make these some kind of small. But I think five is looks pretty nice here. Um, so that is adding in your row. All right, good luck. Thanks.